I decided I wanted to make a video about baby legs. I, they're a trend right now, especially in the States, and I know there's a lot of grandparents and um, people who just don't get it. So here is my spiel for why I like baby's leggings, not just the baby leg brand. So right now, Scarlett is wearing the baby leg brand. You can see the logo on her heel right there. First of all, they're stinking cute. Look at her, my little rainbow bright baby. If you guys are on my Facebook, then you've seen that this is my profile picture. Actually, she's wearing a different pair of rainbow ones on Facebook. Um, there's lots of different baby leggings. These ones are Fuzzy Buns brand, and they do a good job of advertising the Fuzzy Buns diapers because they put this right where it's under their thigh. So you're looking at that by their little tushy. And then we have the Agoo brand. I think that's this. No, these ones are baby legs. Oh, these ones are agoo. Is that how you say that? Agoo. I don't know. Um, these ones are made with bamboo. They are the softest ever, and they're so um, long. Like, they definitely will go with the life of the legging wearer. The fuzzy buns are really soft, too. I like them a lot. And we have tons and tons. I have entire drawer fulls. So here's the Baby Legs logo. They're the most popular ones. Oh, you want that? She wants that. Sorry. I'll show you on this packaging. Um... Shows some cute little girls wearing them, little toddler girls. Super cute. And then on the back, they kind of give a really good quick marketing picture. Shows that it can go all the way from that tiny little crawler up to scratchy daddy arms who doesn't want to touch his precious baby with the scratchy sides of his arms. I don't know, but whatever. They're showing how you can wear them like that too. So um, not only are they cute, but if you live in a climate like I do, it gets really hot later in the day, but it starts out super cold. So I can put her in a nice long sleeve t-shirt and her diaper and then just throw some baby legs on. As it heats up throughout the day, I just have to pull them off. Um, Scarlett also doesn't like having thick waistbands around her waist. I don't know why, but she always pulls at them. So baby legs work really well for us. She only has to deal with the diaper around her waist. They also show off her little cloth diaper. I'll lay her on her back and see if she'll stand it for a second. Chances are she'll flip over immediately and grunt at me, but we'll try it. What you got, little girl? So they're really cute for showing off your cloth diaper. There she goes, grunting and flipping. Yeah. And um, obviously diaper changing doesn't change throughout the day. It's so easy. I just have the diaper right there to deal with. No pants to pull on and off if you have a squirmy kid. Right now she's good at diaper changes. Look at her. She's going to display how she can go back to a sitting up position. Yeah? Yeah. But if you have one of those kids that hates diaper changes, then Baby Legs makes that a lot simpler too while they're arching their back and everything. Um, obviously when she's crawling, she's not going to rub her knees, but here is the absolute biggest Baby Legs seller, or Baby's Leggings seller. There it is. And she's sitting up again. My biggest seller on these deals is when you are gonna go on any type of car ride, you know how cars get really overheated, or if you wanna roll down your window, then they're chilled all of a sudden. Taking those five-point harnesses apart and having to put the kid, you know, in them, take them out to get their pants off and then put them back in is just, I hate that. That's probably my biggest parenting pet peeve, having to undo and redo those harnesses because she hates getting taken out and then being put back in. It's like, somebody's freeing me from my shackles and then you put her right back in it. So with a set of baby legs, all I have to do or baby's leggings, I should say. It doesn't have to be the Baby Legs brand. It's just pull them off. Pull them off. Pull them off. Pull them off. Was that funny? Was that funny? Let's do that with this one. Pull it off. You want to do it? You pull it off. Oh, tell me about it. Here, you can have it. You want it? <laughs> so, that's the best thing. They're great for traveling. You guys, Scarlett has decided to share with you... She's going to give out this set of baby legs. I don't know if the color comes across. They're kind of a plummy, kind of a um, burgundy, and then they have polka dots. Set of baby legs to someone in the comments. Let's see. I'm going to think up a really good question. Maybe I'll have Ryan think of a question. And the first person to answer it correctly, I will send you out this set of baby legs. They are um, one size fits most. And I think they would be girls, although I guess a boy can pull off burgundy polka dots. It's kind of like a necktie pattern. And we will send them out to you. Say right? Say yes, we will. <laughs> she loves her little leggings. <laughs> what classical music piece was I playing before we left for the cabin? There you go. Answer that. First person, I'll send you baby legs. Here's a snapshot of some of our collection for Scarlet. I pulled these ones out of her bin, and I have a whole lot more in there. 
And by bin, oh goodness, I'm talking to Louise too much. Now when I say bin, I think of rubbish and trash cans. And obviously my little baby luxury item here does not go in a bin. Um, by that, I mean little baby beauty boxy bin, this thing. Now back to the baby leggings. Now back to the bin. Now back to the baby leggings. Anybody know what I'm referencing there? It made me think of a commercial, so I did it. Um, I'm going to show you guys a comparison of the prices and the softness and the lengths really quick here. So obviously the shortest ones here are these ones. They're called My Little Leggings. You can get them on Amazon. These ones are, are My Little Legs, that's what they're called. These ones are um, the Agu and they are a lot longer and they're the ones that are soft like butter. These ones are, they're the bamboo-y ones whatever you say that word as. These ones are fuzzy buns, and they are even longer. And then we have baby legs, which are the most popular brand, and they are kind of middle of the road in length. But you know what, that's just a preference. I don't really care about how long they are. Definitely not between these three. These ones might not last as long because they're so short. They might look weird on a four-year-old, who knows? I don't think it's really that big of a deal. Softness, these are the softest a little less, a little less, and least, but still all of them I would buy again. They're not like scratchy, they're still kind of like, um, kind of like athletic socks, softness, where these ones get more like luxuriousness as it goes up. So price points, they range between 12 to $16 a pair, and I think that's absolutely outrageous for a little tube of cute for your kid who's, you know, she's not gonna he or she is not going to die without them. So I always get them on deal sites. What I mean by that is, you know, like Groupon, where they have a deal a day. There's also mom sites that sell baby products with the same sort of premise. So you can get them off of Zulily, Mamapedia, Baby Steals, Totsy. The list goes on and on for those. If you're not subscribed to those and have no interest in subscribing to all of those just to wait for baby leggings to come up, you can add me on Facebook and I will send out the links on my status whenever baby leggings come up. I did not pay more than $4.95 for any of these pairs because I got them all on steel sites. So that's how you can get them on the cheap. What else do I have to say to you? Um, you know, the one thing that I think these are really practical for, other than the five-point harness thing, and other than the cuteness and all that, is crawling. You definitely want to have something protecting those little crawling knees. Scarlet gets really red crawling on our carpet. Her little knees get really red, and if we pulled up the carpets like we're planning to, then they're going to get really bruised because we have hardwoods underneath. So just putting some baby leggings on really helps with that. Definitely a plus for those. All right, I think that's my spiel. Am I a professional reviewer yet? Vanna fingers, lovely, or is that jazz hands? I think it's a little combo. And whoever wins these ones, congratulations to you in the future. Um, I think I'll put some Beeble bloopers at the end, right now. Hey, cutie popper. Thinking tongue, there's the thinking tongue. Where's your thinking tongue? Oh, there it is, comes back out. Very important business to attend to. Gotta get all my papers aligned. That goes over. Man, it needs to be a little bit closer to me. Jeez, if my head's this big, why aren't my arms longer? I don't I just I don't understand that. I'll have to go get it. Come here. Oh wait, this is more important because I'm gonna be sending this out to somebody. I should keep it close by so that you know, gotta get their address. Remember that. Hmm. I wonder. Should I have kept these ones? I do like them. Kinda go with my skin tone. Might be good colors for the holidays. Maybe I should keep them. I don't know. They sound nice. See if they taste good. Oh, I won't. I guess I won't taste them if they're going to go to somebody else's house. That might be rude. Come here, stick pole thing. I need you. Could you just line up? Shape up. Come on. Baby leg stuff we're doing here. You have a tag on you. I'm very interested in that. What does it say? Made in China? Not interested anymore. Oh, I'll taste them. Okay, they're good. Yes, good quality. We can send them out, right? Yeah? Say, get on it, mommy. Send them out. Uh, that thinking tongue. You want the camera? Whoa. Beeble vision. Beeble vision. Uh-oh. Whoa. Goodbye.